We manage the function of the OECD that's around convening policymakers. So what we're trying to do is both produce the evidence and make sure that the evidence gets communicated in a usable way to policymakers. And then we hope that that leads to better policies at the end of the trail. What I think is really important is this idea that together you can have a bigger impact. Just having facts is probably not going to change minds all the time. We actually have to have mechanisms where different views can be expressed and exchanged to try to see where there's a common ground. What's shifted a bit over the past years is this recognition that you have to really adopt a food systems approach because what we're asking the agriculture and food sector to do is not only feed the world, but also to make sure that there are sustainable livelihoods for all the actors and we need the sector to be environmentally sustainable. One of the big issues that's coming at policymakers across the board is how's the agriculture and food sector going to contribute to public goods like addressing climate change, biodiversity, the water impacts of agriculture. Recently, there's been a lot of attention around what are the ways that the sector can evolve to actually be contributing in a positive way. We need to make sure right now that we're creating spaces where we can have conversations around what needs to change and how to make the change happen.